just finished putting on one of my spur costumes. They had asked us to pack spurs so that we wouldn't have people randomly switching costumes every day and causing confusion when I turned play throughout the room. Good morning to all my wonderful guests. Well, I guess the mansion is big enough to wear on the PA system. I hope everyone slept well because you're all going to need your energy. It's too early for this. The first task is about to begin. Should we at least get breakfast first? Each team has been assigned a meeting room and everyone should be receiving a page with directions and the task object to write about no. As he said that a sheet of paper slid under the door into the room. Did he seriously have his stuff? Good luck! Another tone signaled the end of the announcement. Might as well get this over with, maybe then I'll get to it. Yeah, all she brings is food, so don't be surprised, guys. I swiftly made my way to the meeting room to see Mr. Wolf already there looking around. Good morning, Mr. Wolf. Ah, uh, Miss Archer. Good morning. So, um, any ideas where the rest of our teammates are? Or it will be getting breakfast soon? I'm starving! I'm not sure I haven't really met them. I uh, might have an edge bar if you want it. That. Before I could finish responding, the door swung open to reveal an irate Mr. Bandages. What is this? It's not my page down onto the table. My skill sheet? Exactly! A skill sheet, except there are no skills. It would be just like Eric to put me in a group of useless people. Calm down, mommy. What kind of gentleman refers to a lady as useless? Yeah, you see, it's mommy's sweetheart's great companion. The clown walked into the room and perturbed by Mr. Bandages. What did you just call me? That is hardly important right now. You're right, what is important is this task. I refuse to lose this game of his. Again, you mean? It's not like you've ever won. And how would you know that? The previous winners were all either females, old men, or child stars. Really, it's not that hard to figure out. Seemingly finished with that conversation, the count turned his attention from Mr. Bandages to me. Miss Archer, it's delightful to see you again. Yeah, he's a charmer. At least he's nice, not like Mr. Bandages. Likewise, I honestly wasn't expecting to be put into a team with anyone I met yesterday. It must be fate, although I do apologize for you having to put up with Mr. Living Dead over there. What a charma! I was safe from having the answer by the arrival of the waiter willing in a breakfast car. Food! Yes! Perfect timing, I was starting to get a bit hungry. This isn't the time for food. Well, you're a model, so you you were taught to like starving, so you don't really have a, you know, a point here, because your, your way of seeing food is different than everyone else, so. There's always time for food. Exactly, Emma. Exactly. We do need energy. You've been out for it, Mr. Grumpy. Fine. We also down to eat a delicious food. Mr. Bandages didn't even wait for us to finish eating before bringing up the game again. 
The first task seems easy enough. It's finding and opening a door, right? Yes, but knowing her is probably not that simple. The task requires three people, so I would say you're right. What happens to the fourth person? They will be taken to the goal area by the staff to wait for the others to arrive. I don't know why you're telling her this. It was written on page with a task! I hadn't actually bothered to read more than the directions earlier. I can um, sit out if no one else wants to, that is. Your skills might actually be useful. It's Miss Sacha who apparently has no skills, so she should sit out. Hey, I have skills? Well, what are they? I... I know guys, you might think it's Jesus, but we are going for a specific road I know how to play, so... Forgive me. I know how to drive a man crazy. As you realize, Mr. Wolf escaped because he is just so embarrassed by that. And this little green, I love how she is grinning, it's so cute. And how the count is so happy with that, I was sad. <laughs> it's just, it's just so lovely. Well. I would certainly like to test those skills of yours out. A choking noise had me suddenly turning to our coffee Mr. Wolf, whose face, what if what I could see of it anyway, was beet red. It's so, it's so cute. I mean, it's just one simple sentence and he is completely shaken. Are you okay? F fine, perfectly fine. No, nothing's wrong. That's enough foolishness. Miss Archer, you will sit this out as you have no worthwhile skills. Hey, who died and made you a leader? No. I'm the most logical member of our team, so it's only natural. There's nothing natural about it. And it requires people's skills, which you obviously lack. Do you want to be a leader? Because that timid wolf certainly isn't going to do it. No. I didn't think so. If I say, will I miss such a lead? <clears throat> what use is a leader who... All in favor? Oh, <laughs> for him it's all in favor! <laughs> oh, all those flirts and channel, oh, Angie. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I I'm not opposed. I guess I don't have a problem with it. I can be your leader, you freaking Mr. Live and Death. You've been out for that again. You may want to work on those people's skills of yours. Fine. I'm not going to argue about this. Well, leader, how should we proceed? Uh, do we know about this door we need to find? It's hidden and has a special lock. That's it? Pretty much. <laughs> 